and good morning. Uh, the back to school rush is about to begin and with that comes more opportunities for young people to visit stores that sell lottery products. On behalf of the New Jersey Lottery, I am joining with the Council on Compulsive Gambling of New Jersey to remind residents that it is illegal for anyone under the age of 18 to purchase or sell lottery tickets. All of our retailers are committed to preventing underage lottery purchases and today we are grateful to Speedy Mart retailer Terry Fawaha for allowing us the use of his store to share this valuable information. As part of its continued commitment to responsible play and the prevention of underage gambling, the Lottery is supplementing its ongoing responsible play initiatives by launching a statewide redistribution of the Not 18 Yet No Bet brochure to our Lottery retailers. This brochure provides information about the major types of teen betting and signs to recognize that could indicate problem gambling in teens. In addition, the brochure directs concerned individuals about where to go to get advice and help. It will be at, available at each of the more than 6,500 lottery retailer locations, at all lottery-sponsored exhibits and events, and through the lottery website, njlottery.net. The New Jersey Lottery has maintained a long-standing cooperative relationship with the Council in Compulsive Gambling and continues to support the vital mission of the Council. At this time, I am happy to recognize Donald Weinbaum, Executive Director of the Council on Compulsive Gambling of New Jersey, who will accept from me for distribution through the Council's high school information sessions, supplies of the brochure, and pencils containing the message, Lottery is Net Child's Play. Donald, I'd like to give you a supply of the uh, brochures. Uh, we will provide you with as many as you need. Right. <laughs> along with uh, pencils to be handed out throughout the school districts that you visit to give the message that uh, betting is not child's play. Thank you, uh, Carol. Good morning. Uh, I'm Donald Weinbaum. I'm Executive Director of the Council on Compulsive Gambling of New Jersey. And I'm very happy to join Carol and the other lottery officials today in calling attention to the issue of underage gambling. Our council has a long history of working with the New Jersey Lottery and is pleased to be partnering with them on this Not 18 uh, No Bad Yet campaign. The Council on Compulsive Gambling of New Jersey is best known for our 1-800-GAMBLER 24-hour helpline. You'll see that number on all New Jersey lottery tickets and in other lottery advertising. I want to tell you it is a very effective awareness message and it's helped get the word out that help is available for those who need it. But the council also works with communities and families to prevent the onset of problem gambling. The research tells us that early gambling is a risk factor that can increase the likelihood of developing a problem later in life. That's why the Not 18 Yet No Bet campaign is so important. As Carol mentioned, our council conducts a broad array of prevention activities throughout the year, including more than 60 presentations to high schools and colleges. We provide training and assistance to teachers, guidance counselors, and student assistance professionals. Our K-12 Prevention Education Curriculum uh, Gambling Awareness Program USA, or GAP, uh, has been very effective in the schools. We distribute DVDs, educational items, including the New Jersey Lottery brochures and materials. And we participate in a variety of community affairs and summer camps. What we do find when we go out into the communities is that some children are already gambling. What they gamble on varies. It could be cards, it could be sports betting, internet, dice, or even casinos but it could also include playing the lottery. And that's why we've been partnering with the lottery on this ongoing campaign. I'd like to share with you a few signs that could be associated with a gambling problem in a team. And some of those are listed on the brochure, asking, uh, taking, stealing money from family, friends, and strangers, selling personal belongings to get money to gamble, bragging about winnings, unexplained absences, increased family uh, conflict, gambling languages, gambling as an important conversational topic for the team. There's a great deal of additional information that we have available on the council's website, 
parents, educators, and others can check it out, www.800gambler.org. We also have live chat available during the day. I'd like to close by encouraging anyone who may have a concern or who just wants to learn more about gambling addiction to give us a call at 1-800-GAMBLER. With the new school year starting soon, the council also would welcome the opportunity to come to any schools or communities that might be interested in our presentations. Thank you. Just to conclude, I'd like to say that the lottery is committed to responsible gambling. And on all of our uh, messages to the public, we emphasize that uh, gambling is for adults, it's not for children, and you should play responsibly. Thank you.